How's it going everybody? My name's Eric. This is another episode of Shipping Tips. We're gonna be going over shipping tips for specific items that we're shipping. I'm gonna walk you through the process, kind of talk it out, what I'm doing, and then what I would do differently in different situations for different item types to hopefully help new or maybe intermediate sellers out there with some shipping ideas or or different practices. With that being said, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please give the video a thumbs up. If you aren't subscribed to the channel, consider subscribing. I will put a link to the shipping tips playlist in the description. You can check that out and let's get into the video. What are we shipping today? We're gonna be shipping some sandals and you already know that because you saw it in the title and the thumbnail. So we sold some sandals and now we have to ship them. For something this small and light, we're going to be shipping USPS and that is the United States Postal Service. That is our carrier that we're gonna be using. There's two different USPS services you could use for sandals. There's the uh, priority mail and then there's first class. First class is under 16 ounces. So we need to weigh our sandals to see if they're gonna be under 16 ounces. So we grab our scale, turn it on, let it boot up in zero, and then put both sandals on or you can put on one and double it. But this is one pounds, 3.6 ounces. So we're not gonna be able to ship these first class. If they were lighter and we were gonna ship them first class, we would just chuck them into unmarked poly bag or we would use a recycled poly bag, something like that. However, because ours are over 16 ounces, we're gonna have to ship it priority mail. The cheapest way to get sandals out would be flat rate envelope. This is the priority mail flat rate envelope. It's one rate and it's your cheapest priority mail rate across the country. But for these specific sandals, I don't think they're gonna fit easily. If they were women's or smaller, maybe we could get them in. I'm just showing you this for demonstrational purposes. This would be the cheapest rate that we could get. It would be a little under $8 to get these shipped. Since they won't fit in that, we go to the next option, which is the flat rate padded envelope, the EP14PE. And if the sandals weighed less than a pound and we were doing the first class rate, you would not be able to use any of the free USPS priority mail materials. You're using a priority mail bag with something that you paid first class shipping is a big no-no. It's using the materials for their non-intended use, violations of terms of service, terms of use, and you don't wanna be doing any of that. So just by kind of putting the sandals over it, it looks like it's gonna fit perfectly fine. I will be bagging both of these sandals. I already bagged one. They sold for $85 and I'm just going to make a little bit better of a presentation by bagging each shoe individually. So I'm gonna bag this one right here. I do use these nine and a half by 12 clear poly bags quite frequently. That's what we're gonna use to bag each individual sandal. And you'll see why I bag them individually in a second. So we have both of these sandals bagged. So I'm gonna slide one into the flat rate envelope and then I'm gonna slide one in kind of the opposite direction into the flat rate envelope. They probably would not have fit stacked on top of each other and that's why I have them just like that. And then we're going to peel this off. Grab the middle, roll it forwards. Grab the sides, roll it forwards. Um, then I'm going to print my label off from my mobile phone to my brother QL1110NWB. You don't have to use a thermal printer. They're nice. You can use a inkjet printer. You also can use a laser printer and then you would print it out on regular paper and just tape it on. However, I have now this nice adhesive label that I'm just going to peel and stick onto my package and now it is good to go. So that was shipping tips episode two how to ship sandals. There are multiple ways to do it. These are just tips to help somebody and guide somebody if they have no idea what they're doing. Buying your shipping through your platform like eBay, Mercari, or Etsy, or wherever is going to be your best bet. If for some reason you're just sending sandals to a friend or family member, you should use a service like Pirate Ship to get the better commercial rates off, um, off of USPS. Standing in the line at the post office is always the last thing you wanna do. It would be more expensive to use UPS or FedEx just for shipping a pair of sandals. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, please give the video a thumbs up. I will leave relative links and tips also in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye.